How are these going to help us learn about space? Watch and I'll tell you. My name is Michelle and I am Cadet Troop 3's leader, Cadet Troop 2835's leader, and Senior Troop 278's leader. And I'm the service unit manager in Apache over here in Elgin in Girl Scouts of Northern Illinois. And I love space. My interest in space started in Girl Scouts, so I'm really excited to share this with you in a digital format. So the, this activity to make a constellation viewer directly ties to Brownie Space Science Adventure. Step four, make a stargazer, make a constellation viewer. But this works for everybody in all settings. You can make this at home to use during the daytime or at night in your bedroom or on a camping experience with your whole troop. You can build a whole set of constellation viewers and have your troop slumber party and figure out which constellation is projected on the wall with your flashlights. So to begin, all the supplies are below in the comments. Have an adult print out some constellations for you. You'll need scissors, construction paper, a glass to make perfectly proportioned circles. Oh, and remember to drink some water. A pencil for drawing those perfect circles a thumbtack, a rubber band, glue stick, and tape. So let's begin. So today, because I also love archery and I'm excited to see you girls at camp, we're gonna do Sagittarius the Archer. Oh, and obviously toilet paper tubes, duh. Um, so we're gonna do Sagittarius the Archer. So what we're gonna do is we are going to cut out Sagittarius. And don't throw away the name at the bottom because you want to remember which constellation you're looking at because this is a great way to help you identify the constellations that are out and about every night. So I'm going to just tape Sagittarius on there so I know that I have Sagittarius. So I have Sagittarius. Don't want to lose him. And Sagittarius isn't going to fit on the toilet paper tube very well. So what I'm going to do is use my cup my paper, my pencil to draw a circle that I can then cut out. So you can use any color construction paper. You can use black, you can use white. So this will just give your constellation something bigger to stand on. So I've got my circle, got Sagittarius. Now I am going to use my glue stick to glue Sagittarius on. I will just stick a Sagittarius right in the center of the circle. Now here's a craft hack. This is how it's going to stay together. You're going to use your scissors and you are going to carefully cut to the white paper, but don't cut through the white paper. So you're kind of making little slits, almost like sun rays. You're gonna go all the way around. We got Sagittarius. And now I'm gonna take my rubber band and I'm gonna use my rubber band to help put the blue paper down. So it's gonna look just like this. I'm not gonna keep the rubber band on forever. The rubber band is just to be my guiding hands. And if it's a little tricky, ask a parent or a friend or a sibling to help you. I'm gonna take some tape. You don't need a lot of tape. I've got about this much per piece. I'm just gonna put tape down. And I'm gonna tape all the way around. And now I can take my rubber band off and reuse it. So now I have my constellation viewer for Sagittarius. So we could look at Sagittarius through the sun, but it's dark. How can I see Sagittarius? This is where your push pin comes in handy. So you're going to carefully take your push pin and push through all of the black holes.
So you can see the holes and you can see Sagittarius now. So it, Sagittarius looks beautiful in the light and tonight I can even see Sagittarius at my window. So have fun making these. You can make a whole collection of these and they fit great in a shoe box. So if you make this, drop a picture in the comments. I can't wait to see it. Bye.